Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Yesterday I found myself in K-Town here in Manhattan and I was walking by the Faith Shop which is a Korean beauty store in the city. I think they have multiple locations but I'm not sure. But I went to the one in K-Town and they were having a sale. So I had to go in and I don't know what happened to me when I got in there but I got a little spendy and I bought a bag full of things so I figured why not do a haul for you um, most of the things in here are from the face shop that I purchased myself but my friend Adrian actually just came back from a trip from um, Korea she was in Seoul and she was kind enough to pick me up a few goodies from there as well so I put those in here too just because it all falls under the Korean beauty theme so let's just get into it um, I'm gonna pull everything out oh and actually as I look here I realize that I sort of mixed up what Adrian got me and what I bought myself, um, so I'm going to try to keep it straight, but Adrian, if you're watching, I'm sorry if I confuse some of the things you got versus what I bought myself, but hopefully I should be able to remember what I chose to buy myself. Um, the main thing that I got were a lot of face masks, so these first three, no, four, Adrian gave me from Korea but they were also at the face shop I saw them there so you can definitely pick them up the state side if you're interested the first one is this real nature lotus face mask and it's it apparently has lotus flower extract I'm really not sure what it's supposed to do okay it does have English on the back. So it says that it moisturizes and gives tired, rough skin a boost of radiance, and it's drenched with a serum and oil. So I'm excited to try that, especially while it's still cold out. My skin is a bit drier. She also got me two Innisfree, I think I'm saying that right, face masks. One is with tea tree and one is with green tea. They look like these. Again, all sheet masks. And so this is, the tea tree oil one is supposed to help the appearance of skin problems while keeping skin moisturized and clean. I think tea tree oil is supposed to be really good for breakouts as well. And the green tea one is supposed to moisturize the skin from deep within for a dewy look. So that will be very nice to try. And then the last face mask she got me is this Real Nature Honey Miel one. It looks like that. And this is moist, it has um, vitamins and mineral rich honey essence that gently moisturizes and adds natural radiance to dry, lackluster skin. So I'm gonna love this because I always feel like my skin looks kind of lackluster in these end of winter months. So those are the ones she picked up from Korea. She also got me a few like really cute samples. I guess they gave her in the store like these little adorable Pokemon samples. I'm not even sure what they are. Oh, they're Tony Moly, um, which is a brand here you can get in the States as well. And I think these are just, there's some kind of cream, but I don't even know what they are. Like, I don't know if these are eye creams or what. So it's all in Korean at the back. So I guess I'm gonna assume it's like some kind of face cream. So I'll use it on my face and then she also got me the sample of the lineage water sleeping mask which i'm really excited to try because this is all the rage here in the states you can get it at target it's supposed to be amazing so i'm definitely going to try this i really i already know i want to buy the lineage water sleeping lip mask so yeah i'm interested to know more about that brand Okay, now we can move into some of the things I picked up myself. Um, like I said, these were on sale, so I have the receipt here. I'll tell you how much I paid for it, although it annoyingly doesn't say what the original price was, and it didn't say in the store, so I'm not sure exactly how much I was saving, but I'm going to assume I was saving some money, I hope. Otherwise, I'm a fool. Okay, first thing I got was this BB lip mask. It's adorable. It has this little girl on the front and it's one of those lip masks that you know you just like peel and put over your lips and it's just supposed to be an intensive lip care mask that turns dry and rough lips into smooth baby like lips my lips are the most dry they have ever been so I am very excited to try this and this was four dollars I think yeah oh wait no 
This was $6. No, okay, sorry, no. This was $3. I bought two of them because I had my friend's birthday party last night, so I took her one of these as well. So this was $3. Not terrible. I also bought these Bright Eyes Modeling Gel Patch Eye Masks the kinds that kind of just go like under your eyes like that. And this is supposed to, um, what is it supposed to do? No idea. It doesn't say what it's supposed to do. Why did I buy this? <laughs> I don't know. I was in like a really weird headspace, so I don't know why I bought this. I'm not sure what I'm expecting it to do. I'm hoping it just like de-puffs and maybe gets rid of some of the dark circles. If an eye patch mask can do that, we'll see. Um, okay, I also picked up two sheet masks. They are the same. I was just a complete sucker for the graphic on the front. Let's be real. I just really liked the graphic. This is a character mask, and these are hydrating sheet masks. As you can tell, that's what I'm very into right now. So yeah, I assume this will just be moisturizing. Um, these were $4 each. Oh, I forgot to mention the eye masks were also $4. Let's see. Oh, these were $6, so a little bit more. And then the last thing I picked up, and I picked up two of them, are the these Smile Foot Peeling Masks. So what these are supposed to do, you've probably seen them, the videos are on YouTube, they are supposed to be this like boot that you put on your feet and then you take it off after an hour and in four to six days, your skin will just start shedding the dead skin that it has and like baby feet will emerge underneath. I have used the original or like the popular baby feet one that you can buy on Amazon and it really worked. It was amazing. It was also 20 or $24 for one. These were 12 for one. I bought two because Luke, my man friend wants to also try them so I decided to treat him so that's why I have two and I just want to see if they work as well as the baby feet one I actually think I'm gonna make this a video for you guys it's gonna be gross I'm warning you and I'll put that disclaimer on when I actually get around to trying this but yeah I think I'm gonna make it a video and you guys can see like how well this actually works because I actually find it fascinating to watch those videos even though it's gross but I like love watching all the skin just like peeling off so get excited for that <laughs> okay so after I purchased all those um, the face mask the face shop actually gave me a few things for free which was nice they gave me this calendula um, real nature face mask which is the same brand as the one that my friend gave me and then they also gave me um, Oh, actually, I think Adrian also brought me these from Korea. Yes, she did. These are samples of Dr. Jart, um, which is also available in the States. And I actually love Dr. Jart's like very rich, intense moisturizer, the Ceramidin, I think it's what it's called. This is different. This is for a serum and I think like a lighter um, cream. So that's separate. The face shop also gave me these two little like eye creams. These are the uh, Yewadam. Uh, revitalizing eye cream two of those so that was very nice and they have such a good reward program if you sign up to be a member with them which is just basically giving you their phone number giving them your phone number you get five percent of every purchase that you make that five percent of that gets credited to your account to use to your next purchase so like all of this was sixty dollars and since it was my first time purchasing with them they actually gave me 10% so I got six dollars off which was really nice um, and I think six dollars goes towards wait what did I actually have it on here does it have it on here yes so my points earned were five five hundred and sixty points so that's five dollars and sixty cents that I can use to my next purchase so that's like probably one of the best reward program things that I have experienced so yeah that's it I'm excited to try out some Korean beauty skincare I've like dabbled in it a little bit but not that much so this will be me like going into it more I definitely didn't need any of this and I'm gonna try not to buy any more masks of any kind for like a year but I always say that and I always fail so 
we'll see. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, please subscribe if you want to see more content from me. I would love that, and I will see you soon. Bye!